We're working on our side seams now. Your instructions say to stop. You, these here are not your side seams. We need to manipulate our material in order that they're going to look like a pair of pants. So what we need to do is we need to place the back pants with the right side facing you. Open up our back pants, or it could be the front. It doesn't really matter. Here my back, there's my hole. Have that facing you. Now you're gonna find the other part, which They're not gonna match up right now. Don't worry about that. Then you're gonna lift them in the air and you're gonna give them a shake. Now that looks more like a pair of pants. Don't worry about this side right now. We're gonna line all that up because remember our back is going to be larger than our front. Now we're gonna pin our sides. So we're gonna pin the top because that's really important. And then we're gonna take a look at the bottom. Now if the bottom didn't match on the one side, then we'll make sure that it is the same on the other side. Okay, and if it did, then great, we can line that up. So I'm gonna pin that side down here, and then I'm gonna stretch in between. And now I wanna make sure that I'm lining up all of my edges, absolutely perfect. Now you're ready to take them to the sewing machine and you're going to sew. Back stitch at the top, sew all the way down to the bottom and back stitch. You want to start from the top and then you repeat on the other leg. Start at the top, do your back stitch, all the way down, do your back stitch. So at a 5, a 2.3. Now I've stitched both sides and they actually look like a pair of pants. I want to multi zigzag my seam allowance, which is where I stitched over to this area with a multi zigzag together. So a five D one point five. 